Hi, thanks for coming by PosterCentral.com's video blog. I'm Pete Howard, and I'm proud to say that I've located what I consider to be the ultimate Michael Jackson concert poster, because it's the ultimate Jackson 5 concert poster. I've been collecting posters uh, for over 20 years, music my whole life, and I was just so thrilled. I've been waiting to find a Jackson 5 concert poster from their first year, 1970. Of course, they really, late, late 69, Diana Ross introduced them and stuff, but 70 was their year. Boy, was it ever their year. This is, by the way, from Jacksonville, Florida, the Jackson 5, and it's uh, December 30th of 1970, so it's a 1970 concert poster. It's just a beauty, isn't it? It's a giant globe, cardboard, 22 by 28 inch, call them a jumbo, and never seen it before until it just came, I just, I just got it um, a little while ago. And uh, it's just a great, nice picture of the J5 on there with Michael right down in front. See if I can uh, do this. There we go. It's, it's a standard publicity shot, but it's still, you know, it's nice to have it on the poster as opposed to just graphics and words. And... I just always wanted a 70 Jackson 5 concert poster. There's a couple of beauties from 72 and 73, and they're large cardboard globes like this. They don't have any song titles on them. And that's already, Jackson 5 was already getting a little long in the tooth by 72 and 73. But in 1970, they had not one, not two, but three top ten albums that year, and a Christmas album, which went to number one. Uh, insane year for the J5, an incredible rookie year for Michael Jackson, and they had, not one, not two, not three, four number one singles in 1970. Um, I want you, you read them off the poster, I want you back, I'll be there, the love you save, and ABC is not mentioned on the poster. So three of the four number ones are plugged on the poster. That's fantastic. The other two uh, Globe posters don't mention any song titles. So 1970, and, and those number one singles were on for a combined total of 10 weeks at number one. So what's that, like 20% of the year? The Jackson 5 was in the top spot? Ne never mind all the other dozens of weeks they were in the top 10 or top 20. So it really was their year. And it's just um, it's just a incredible time for a J5 poster and Michael Jackson's best foot forward when he was, you know, just starting out. And uh, this poster itself is really, it's got a couple of real throwbacks to 60s rhythm and blues and soul posters, which is funny. Um, because just the five they're called, the, the fact they're called the Jackson 5 Review <laughs> instead of just the Jackson 5, and then at the bottom, and their big band. You know, that's just such 60s terminology for like James Brown posters and all kinds of artists that it would say at the Little Richard touring and stuff, it would say, and his big band. Um, so that's really, you know, it's really a lot of 60s elements in this 1970 poster. So just. The bomb for Michael Jackson and J5 fans. I'm just so thrilled to have it. Great day glow colors, uh, great condition, and um, and uh, thought you'd enjoy seeing it today. So thanks a lot for coming by.